Okay, this is a review on the filters. This should be, I think it's the second review, so uh, I'll probably do one more, which is uh, at the end of a year. So we started this on January you know, 2019, and this is almost October. What day is it, Google? Okay, so I was kind of holding off until we got to basically fall. So we're officially in fall right now. And as you can tell uh, from the last update, when we get most of the junk flowing through our water, is almost always during the summertime. I don't know why, but it's just maybe the wells are shallower and they pump more mud or whatever happens. But we got a lot more junk flying through the lines. But that thing was not that dirty. I was kind of wondering if... I think this is a 50 micron and might be better served with a 20 or a uh, maybe even a 10 or something but this basically catches all the really coarse the flat out dirt sand grit grime and you can see kind of more of the solid junk down there at the bottom and then we've got the 5 micron over here and then that's the 1 micron right here and the funny thing actually is, uh, I guess it indicates that our water over here is kind of more fine silt, is the one micron gets a, a discoloration before the five micron did. So that's kind of a little weird. It's not unusual for this one to get dark first, uh, trapping the finer particles, I guess. But it, this filter saves a whole lot of damage done to this. This used to be my frontline filter and it was just getting hammered. So I can probably reduce this down a little bit better, but this is just a coarse filter. I mean, if you were on a well, this would probably be a washable stainless steel screen or something, but we're not quite that bad. But I can get easily about a year out of this, so I'm going to let this go for three more uh, months. And then somewhere around January, when it makes a full year cycle, I'm going to videotape washing this filter off and getting all, all the dirt and crud, because these two are washable. The 50 micron and then the uh, 5 micron are, are, are washable in this orange nasty clay crap dirt whatever I don't know what it is but it's just horrible comes off of there but you can tell these things are working because this one is nice and almost snow white might still be trapping some fine stuff but this is kind of what makes me feel better is if that one's clean then I know it's working and when you go down here this is the filter that's after the charcoal if you're kind of familiar with how this is laid out I'm not gonna get into all those details but this is the last filter before it goes to a UV sterilizer and then into the house. So, real quick, sediment filters here, charcoal, some softener kind of crap thing, and then it goes into this filter, then the UV, then the house, which um, I don't really know what else to tell you guys. That's basically it, but I just wanted to show basically a little progression on these things about every three months, and uh, this one, this one gets pretty nasty looking, so... Okay, see you guys when we come up on a year in January. So this is, I believe, the third video after the install.